Hi, this is Deborah from Dinglefoot.com, and this week we just have an everyday greeting card. So I have a piece of white card stock for my card, and then I have a piece of brown paper, and this is about two inches wide, and it's the length of my card. And what I did was just run it through an embossing folder. So this paper actually has a white core, and when I embossed it, some of the white kind of came through. I don't know if you can see it there, but I'm going to take a piece of sandpaper and just sand it so it has a really nice design and this really shows through. And then I have another piece of paper that's about the same. It's a little bit wider. It's about two and a half inches wide. And I have a piece of white paper that I'm going to mat onto it. So I have two stamps also. I wanted a tall stamp and this could be a flower or a branch or just a swirl like I have. And I have a little bow, and I have some brushed corduroy ink, so I just wanted a matching ink, so I found a brown ink. And then I have a little greeting stamp here, so I'm going to be using that. And I have a corner rounder, so I'll be using that also. So, I'm going to first grab my sandpaper over here, and we will sand our design. Okay, so I'm going to quickly just run my sandpaper over that design. This works really well if you have a white core card stock. See, that color underneath is going to really come through. So just rub it over a little bit. And then this is going to get glued to the front of my card. I'm just going to grab my permanent glue stick here. Okay, so this goes right on the front here. Right to the left side. Okay, so I need to make sure it's lined up there. And then we're going to take these two pieces and going to go around the edges. And before we put these two together, we're going to do the stamping. So, I need a piece of just scrap paper because I'm going to ink up this tall stamp that I have. Okay, so we'll just make sure that's nicely covered. And I don't want it dark on this white piece of paper for my first stamp. So I'm going to stamp once, twice on my scratch paper, and then I'm going to stamp on my tag here that I made. So we just want a light one, okay? So it didn't come out very dark at all, and that's exactly what I want. The second time, we're going to ink up our stamp, and this time we're not going to use the scratch paper. We're going to stamp right next to this image, and I don't want it to be right on it where I stamped before. I want it slightly to the side, maybe even down just a little bit. Okay, so this is almost like a little reflection. Okay, so... Look at that there. We have a very light one and we have a dark one, and that's exactly what I wanted for my tag. So I'm going to take some adhesive here and put it on the back. And this will now go right on the front of this piece. Okay. And this is ready to go right on the front of our card. So I'm going to I'll use my glue stick again. Just going to stick that right on the front of my card. Okay. So it's placed like that. 
And before I finish it, I'm going to take my tiny little greeting that I had here. Hopefully I got that over far enough so I have room. Maybe I better scooch that over while the glue's still wet. I'm going to move that just a tad bit. And I'm going to stamp my greeting right down here in the corner. So I just made room for a little greeting right in that corner. And then all I have to do is put a little bit of glue in the back of a tiny bow. And I'm going to stick that right at the bottom. So we have a very, very simple little everyday greeting card. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching.